Hey everyone, it's Leftovers for Dinner, and I'm here with my buddy Pepper. Hey! Now, if you watched the opening clip, you saw something pretty awesome, and that was me taking pictures, like I always do, hands-free, pretty much, uh, not holding the dogs. Y'all know that I go geocaching and hiking, and I do a lot of photography with the dogs. And a lot of times that means holding on to a leash and fumbling and all sorts of stuff. This is pretty much a review, just like the previous ones. The chest plate harness by Easy Dog. Easy Dog is a pretty cool company. It was founded by a dude named Luke, who was, I guess, in the water sports industry. And he used a lot of the technology that he learned in the water sports industry to develop dog products, because, you know, dogs are awesome and they like sports too. So this is going to be a review of both the chest plate harness and the very O6 light leash. Uh, there is a very O6 leash and a light version of that leash available. We got the light because Pepper is light. She is only 14 pounds. <laughs> now, the cool thing about this harness is, well, actually one of the many cool things is that it's got a chest plate. As you can see, we have worn this harness a lot. We have thoroughly tested it. So there's a little bit of stuff, but we won't, we'll just overlook that. It's got a chest plate, but it's a soft, chest plate and what happens is the EVA molding or construction over time molds to your dog's breastbone plate or breastbone area where their breastplate is and what that basically does as far as getting control of your dog is that when you have to halt I'm trying to come here pepper let's get back into the frame <laughs> when you halt or yield your dog in a certain situation, the pull is right here along the breast. And that, you know, from like dog psychology, essentially halts most dogs, which is important. Now, it does have a crisscross design, really sturdy stitching right here with an appropriate size D ring for your size dog. You're just being so sweet. Um, the buckles, webbing, the straps, everything are appropriately sized for your dog, which is very important because just like people, one size does not fit all. And this is basically how it closes up. Fully adjustable straps so that you can adjust it to your dog's size. Um, to be honest, we have had a little bit of trouble finding the perfect size in the base or around the girth for Pepper, but that's because of how she is so uniquely shaped because she is a mixed breed. Come over here. Come on, Pep. Come on, good girl. She is a mixed breed. She has a longer torso that is kind of, kind of hot dog dash houndish. Some of the harnesses we've tried so far, very, very uncomfortable and I want her to be comfortable. Sometimes I've had to tighten them down to the point of where I'm like, wow, that kind of looks like it might hurt. And then I loosen it up. And what happens when I loosen it up? It flips off of her or falls off of her. And that's not cool. So far, that is one awesome thing. Using this harness, it has not fallen off, flipped off, tugged off, or anything. And I can't say enough positive things about how important that is, especially if you have a dog that you take hiking, you take on the road for road running, jogging. Um, when it gets warmer, we're actually going to start jogging Pepper. And I want to be sure that my dog is safe. So that's always important. And that's another thing. Almost no slipping with this harness. Uh, we have been using another harness in the past. And I've noticed after a few adventures, it starts to slip. Not this one. So there we go. And as you can tell, she's actually really comfortable. Hey, Pepper. <laughs> That's nice. She likes us. She does. She 
stays secure. And let's just show you guys when she has to yield. That's pretty much it. That's really good. Now, this harness, good harness. But in conjunction with their Vario 6 light leash, it's amazing. And this is the Vario 6 leash. If you notice, there's these little black things. Let's see if you guys can see those. Yep. You can also hear my bigger dog, Ben, in the background. <laughs> but yeah, there's these little black hole things. Well, these are actually so that you can convert this leash into a multi-purpose leash. There's several different functions of this leash. So we're going to put the leash on. There we go, Pepper. Yay! And we're going to go ahead and pause real quick and show you guys some of the different features. One really cool thing about the Vario 6 light leash is that when you get it, it actually has a little uh, plastic piece that shows you some of the top various uses or various methods you can use the leash. We were actually trying to look for that and we didn't find it. So we're just going to go over with you some of the ones that we use. Now you can go on their website and look up the different methods of using the Vario leash uh, or you can actually order their brochure which actually has a really cool diagram with different methods. Let me show you that now. There you go. Now the one that we actually use is the double dog leash and the short tether. The short tether is super easy. We take this end of the leash, put it through a belt loop, and then just hook it just like that. And it's super secure. Seriously, this is a very tough leash for such a small dog. A lot of times when I go shopping for Pepper, uh, some of the boutique style stuff, it's just not as durable. And we are outdoor people. So this durability right here, pretty impressive. Another method that we have actually used is putting it through the belt loop again, then pushing this through and then actually attaching this to a secondary leash or an extension so that I can have both the dogs on my belt, which is cool because that means I'm hands-free to take some photos or continue hiking or geocaching, you know, all the outdoor hobbies that we love. In fact, we'll show you a couple of clips of that now. Now, I do have a use for this leash that's not listed in the tutorials or on the website, but it's just my own personal take on how to use this. Uh, also, little known feature or awesome fact, the Easy Dog chest plate harness comes with a car restraint, which is a super rugged, durable piece of um, hardware, as well as basically like commercial grade nylon, which is really cool with the Easy Dog logo. Now, what I do is I'll actually take the leash, push it through here, and then snap this closed. Now, yes, that does make this happen, but once I've done this, I can actually strap Pepper to either my coat or my photography backpack, which makes it very convenient as a photographer because that means I don't have her pulling on my hips or on my wrist and I can get those shots, those photography shots that need a little bit of stability, you know, no jerking dog, no movement. Now, one of the most common uses of this leash are the traffic harness or traffic leash, which is basically where you go like this and go like that. And that allows a shorter leash, because this is a very generous leash, it allows a shorter leash for more control in traffic or populated areas. I know many of us, like me, live in areas that have leash control laws, so the ability to adjust this leash 
to a shorter one is very important. You don't want to get a ticket and you also want to keep your dog safe. So, so far we are very happy with this, le this leash and this harness. We originally got the harness because we were looking for something different than the usual harnesses that we have. <laughs> Thank you, Pepper. It's January now and it's very cold outside. Pepper is a long hair Chihuahua mix, but she actually has, you know, thin fur. So what we have been doing with this easy dog leash, and I know everybody's gonna love this, is we've been wearing it with clothes. How awesome is that? Okay. Oh yes, put the sweater on. Let's be warm. <laughs> okay, there we go. She has regular sweaters so that she can go pee or go in, out in the backyard. When we actually go hiking, we put a full like outdoor gear jacket on her and both the outdoor gear jacket and her little sweaters that we have, all you have to do is find the D-ring on the easy chest plate harness an easy dog chest plate harness, and then there you go. We still have the full protection and guidance of a harness while being warm, and that is just an incredible advantage. The fact that this harness is so versatile and fits under clothes, little dog clothes, which my dog actually needs. Come on, Pepper. See that? Yeah, fits under there. Let's give everybody a side profile, Pepper. Come on. Come on, let's get up. Come on. <laughs> she is just not wanting to play for the camera today. No, um, she looks great and we love it. So great job to Easy Dog. We're giving the harness four and a half stars because we are still fidgeting with the girth, but it's a very well built harness. So big props on that. The Vario leash, the fact that we can adjust this to meet our needs and be photographers and be geocachers and hikers and do all our outdoor stuff hands-free. Seriously, five stars. If I could give it six, I would. I am in love with this leash. Oh, look at that reflective stitching. Isn't that awesome? Yeah, <laughs> another great feature of the Easy Dog products. So we're gonna say bye, Pepper. Bye. And we hope you liked our little review. Let's end it with some footage. Yeah.